It could make the difference between leaving a child in a wheelchair and allowing them to run around like any other. Yes, Sheffield Children's Hospital needs £75,000 for a new scanner to help treat children with brittle bone disease from all over the north. Our health correspondent Penny Bustin has been to meet one young girl who will benefit from a brand new scanner. She swims competitively, sings in a choir, plays the violin and is a girl guide. 11-year-old Holly Gervin hasn't let her brittle bone condition beat her. She's just getting to grips with new crutches and settling into grammar school. She was born with a fractured arm and two fractured legs through osteogenesis imperfecta, an inherited form of osteoporosis. Her early childhood was dominated by fractures. In 2000, she started a new groundbreaking drug treatment at Sheffield. It's been so successful, she hasn't had a fracture for nearly five years. Right then, Holly, it's just the scan you've had many times before. Every five months, she's back for another scan to check her progress. It's this machine that needs to be upgraded. £75,000 would buy the latest model. This is the country's biggest childhood bone disease centre and the scanner will be used to monitor and improve treatment for more than 700 children. Well done, sweetheart. Well, if you look at this image here, the new scanner will give us a, uh, an image that is X-ray quality, crystal clear. We'll be able to see individual bones from the DEXA scan and it will considerably reduce the radiation dose that the children are getting year on year. It'll be a major advance for the care of these children. Can I just feel under your jumper? My fingers are cold now, sorry. Without the care of Professor Bishop and his team, Holly would have had a very short back and limbs and no prospect of being mobile. Next spring, she's off to Poland singing with her choir without mum. So when you're lying there on the scanner, what, what's it doing? It's measuring my bone density so they can see how the drug is improving their bones. And how does it feel when you're on it? Um, normal. And they need a new scanner. What will that do? It will make it a bit faster and it will give us new information. And that will help you? Yes. Holly will spend tonight in the children's hospital after another five-hour infusion of the drug that is strengthening her bones and strengthening her future. Penny Bustin, BBC Look North, Sheffield. Let's hope she enjoys that singing yeah, yeah, trip. Definitely. Well done, Holly.